Have you ever heard a story that really got your attention and kept you totally captivated for anywhere from a few minutes to a few hours? Have you ever read a book that you couldn't put down and you would ignore everything and anything else until you could finish it? Is there a movie that you ever watched that you could watch over and over and over and over again for years and years and years? And have you ever heard a sales story that got you so excited that you had to buy even though you weren't 100% sure why you needed the product you were buying? And the chances are that the reason was because the story, whether it's the movie, the book, or the sales copy, followed the formula. And the formula is called the hero's journey. Hey guys, Jim Edwards here, and welcome to another edition of Letting the Chickens Out with Jim. As you can see, we have lots of chickens. And um, the, the funny thing is, is that the hero's journey has been around for thousands and thousands of years. And it's a story format that virtually every good story ever told follows pretty much perfectly. And we just did, well, a little while ago, we did a podcast about the hero's journey. It was podcast number five of the Sales Copywriting and Content Marketing Hacks podcast. And you want to go check that out. This, uh, tomorrow, I'm teaching a class in the Jim Edwards Method Premium on the hero's journey story, how to use it, where to use it, examples. Plus, I'm releasing a brand new wizard that walks you step by step by step through using that wizard to create the perfect hero's journey script. And uh, we used it yesterday with my buddy Stu Smith, and uh, we, I used it too, and he was just blown away by it. But the big thing you need to understand is everybody's looking for formulas and blueprints and all that good stuff. And I'll tell you right now, if you want to tell a great sales story, you need to learn how to tell a hero's journey. Because the hero's journey can be about you, it can be about a product, it can be about somebody else, it can be about a situation, it can be about a group of people. It's like the Swiss Army app of stories that works because it hits people right in the heart. It, for whatever reason, is hardwired into the human psyche that this is the story, this is the pattern, this is the, this is the one. So I just throw that out for you. Um, go check out that podcast episode. You can do it at the jimedwardsmethod.com forward slash podcast, I believe is the, I should know the damn link if I'm going to make the thing, right? Um, but you can go check it out. We've got our podcast episodes up on the blog, but it's episode number five. I'll draw, I draw out the picture for you of the story arc that it goes through. We give a cool example, but uh, this is something we're going to be focusing a lot more on coming up because this is something that can make a huge difference in your in the magnetism of your stories and your ability to sell and all kinds of cool stuff so that's it for letting the chickens out with jim go check out the podcast if you haven't already and uh you have a great day and we'll talk to you soon bye bye everybody